Honestly, I never thought I'm gonna buy this. The Aquara Mini Switch. Let's see what it's all about. It's a Zigbee device, it has three configurable actions and a two-year battery life. Inside, we will find the manual, a spare adhesive ring and the button. The button is quite small. It has a pull tab over here in order to activate the battery. And of course, we should have a pairing button. And that's it about the package. By the help of this adhesive ring, you can take this device almost anywhere, being suitable also to be placed under the desk, like a special silent alarm system. Anyway, let's see how easy it is to connect it in Home Assistant. Let's go to Zigbee to MQTT. Here we have a list of the devices. Permit join. Now all we need to do is press the pairing button. Done. This is the switch. Let's edit this switch and we're gonna call it button. It is an end device and no data yet over here. All we have to do now is create a simple automation. Let's see, automations and scenes. Create new automation. Uh, new automation, trigger. When the device, let's see if we have the button. Button, yeah. trigger single action because it has one click, two clicks or long press, then do, let's say the light, toggle, if it's on I want to turn it off, if it's off I want to turn it on, and light toggle, let's see what device, bedroom, bedroom light, save, let's call it toggle bedroom light. And we're done. After two minutes of hard work, your new mini remote control is ready. See you in the next video.